Next up on the channel, we got one of the hottest releases this year for Marvel Legends. We're looking at the Marvel Legends series, Captain America, Dum Dum Dugan, Nick Fury Jr., and Sharon Carter 3-pack. Only way I got it figured. The way I got it figured. What's up, figure fans? We well, I got it figured back with another Marvel Legends review. This time we're looking at the Shield 3 pack from Marvel Legends. Picked this up at GameStop um, a little while ago, a few weeks back, and finally getting around to reviewing it. I know there have been many reviews before I've gotten to it. Wanted to get, get through with it before July was over, but I've been waiting for this pack. It's one of the big releases of this year that I was uh, planning on, on getting, and it's here. So the Shield 3 pack includes Dum Dum Dugan, Timothy Dugan, Nick Fury Jr., and Sharon Carter. And they are obviously all top Shield agents. And then you get, of course, the alternate head for Nick Fury Sr., if you want to go that route, I'm not going to go that route, but it's nice to know that it's there. I would almost really kind of feel like I need to buy either another Nick Fury Jr., separate of the pack, or get another pack, and then change out the heads for other characters or something like that. But as this pack is like 75 bucks, it's, you know, kind of problematic. So... Um, Nick Fury Jr. is going to be the figure, but you know, obviously I'll show the head and everything like that when we get to it. So checking out the package, we have got our three principles in here. You get alternate heads as well for Sharon Carter. Got your shield logo, even though it's a Captain America branded product. You got your Jonathan Hickman Secret Wars, Secret Warriors rather, artwork, and some Sharon Carter artwork from the Ed Brubaker Captain America era. And then of course you got Nick Fury Jr. got separate portraits for each as per normal they actually didn't um, didn't do like a weapons thing on the back it's just kind of just kind of some portraits which is fine you can see everything in the front anyway but we're not going to look at this stuff like that we're gonna look at it out of the package. So let me get on with that and we'll get into it. All right, so it should be pretty easy to see. We've got ourselves another bevy here, more accessories that you can shake a stick at. Um, Nick Fury Jr. and Dum Dum come with the exact same accessories except for a couple of things well it's all the same but nick fury comes with a little bit more so nick fury jr comes with his dad's head nick fury senior as well as nick fury senior's classic shield issue needler pistol a must if you're gonna do the classic Nick Fury. And then Sharon Carter comes with several accessories and we'll go over those as well. Certainly not to diminish her in any way. We'll get to her. So starting with your accessories, you're going to get this, you know, kind of fictional shield type machine gun. 
the magazine does not come out and is worth noticing, noting that because this is Marvel Legends, not G.I. Joe Classified series. Then you get some high-tech pistols to come with several figures, um, but these have paint apps on them for sil silver paint apps. Of course, as you can see, this is, you can see it's silver. You get a knife, even though it's not immediately. Uh, obvious where the knife goes and then you get two sets of hands so of course they're wearing fisted hands right now but you get the kind of command hand or you know like uh, bullseye like pointing pointing at you a kind of a gripping hand and you get two trigger fingers so I'm not going to go over Nick Fury Jr's um, accessories because they're the same accessories then you get two red blast effects which we've seen before and then two smoke effects So then moving over to Sharon Carter, you get four hands. And these hands are hands we've seen before, much like most of this figure. Two yellow blast effects, but they're the same blast effects as the red ones. Two smoke effects as well. Everybody gets smoke effects. And then you get these two pistols that come with virtually every Black Widow figure known to man. In addition, you get an alternate portrait for Sharon. A lot of people are using these to customize other characters with them, but in my house, Sharon Carter's heads are Sharon Carter's heads. So going from left to right, we'll start with Dum Dum Dugan. And he is on a cool, kind of almost like fat guy body. I don't want to say fat. But, you know, he's got a little punch to him, even though he's in good shape. He is completely pinless. His bowler hat is on his head. And a fun fact about Dum Dum Dugan, I believe it was in the Secret Warriors comic itself. Uh, that Nick Fury sort of reveals that Dum Dum is a LMD. Which makes sense because, you know, he'd be 3,000 years old. And only Nick Fury got to use the infinity formula that keeps him young. So it kind of makes sense. Next, we've got Nick Fury Jr., a.k.a., I don't want to call him Calvin Johnson, because that's Megatron, but his name is Johnson. I can't forget his, I can't not remember his first name, uh, but he was given a different, the name of his mother, so that Nick Fury's son wouldn't be, Nick Fury wouldn't be vulnerable to somebody finding out about his family. Captain America uh, was a series called Battle Scars uh, where they were trying to, to kill him and Captain America came and helped him out and stuff. 
but he is wearing the sort of executive shield outfit that Nick Fury Sr. would be wearing. And they did a thing on his neck so that you could change the head out without it compromising the skin tone. So he's just got a full thing on his neck. And he's on the Vulcan body, so he's got butterflies. As well as pinless joints all around. Yeah, there you go. And last but not least, again, just going from right to left, we've got what I mainly wanted out of this set, number one, two, and three, of course, in priority, is Sharon Carter. And you have seen this body before because this is the second figure to be on the new Black Widow body that was released last year with the Earth's Beyond Earth's Mightiest program which I'll link to, um, but she is from the head down, from the neck down, the exact same figure. She got a nice nifty holster to differentiate her, and she's got different feet, so she's got, you know, kind of shoes with heels on them. So they gave her an, elect an, a, an athletic body um but you know sharon isn't quite as athletic as black widow but she can hang and they were both together on the even though this is a newer outfit for sharon with the exposed shoulders they were on the secret avengers together with uh commander rogers so you have that kind of connection going and it's agent 13 of shield and she's got a portrait which I did show a little earlier but let's show it again extra portrait and it is the same face just with a new different hairdo Steve Rogers' best girl in the comic book. And there's an upgrade from the previous Sharon Carter, which I do have. Um, but I didn't pull it out for this review. But I'm probably going to do like a S.H.I.E.L.D. team video of all the S.H.I.E.L.D. agents that I have. And so I'll pull it out for that. So there you have it. There's your S.H.I.E.L.D. 3-pack. So I guess what we'll do next, before we get into the nitty gritty, so there you go, you got Nick Fury Sr. with his classic Needler pistol. All right, so we got our shield three pack team geared up I don't know we got a bunch of accessories in the way but they look great and you got some extra stuff you can use to customize or give extra hands to um, if you have the shield uh, three pack of you know army builders from two years ago so you can do that and these guys are all intimately familiar with Steve Rogers Cap. Get them all 
time girlfriend. And yeah, they look cool together. They look definitely cool. Nice figures on nice bodies. The uh, Black Middle Widow mold was one of my favorite figures of 2023. So it's, you know, it's a high power mold. And I'm glad to see Sharon Carter got it. So, you know, definitely want to have a badass Agent 13. And we've got that. So that's going to do it for this one. I'm going to move on to final thoughts. Final thoughts on the Marvel Legends Shield 3-pack with Dum Dum Dugan, Nicholas Fury Jr., and Sharon Carter. Yeah, I'm very happy with this set. It's exactly what I thought it was going to be. Certainly wanted to get it. Um, sort of rounds out my Shield team. And yeah, it's gonna it's gonna be great to have these guys. I'm definitely gonna do some kind of um, shield, you know, video with all the shield agents that I have, and uh, it's gonna be cool. So yeah, so be on the lookout for that. Maybe next month. But these guys, pretty much great. They're rocking all the new pinless tech. The new Black Widow body. Um, and yeah, I'm all about it. I'm going to give this set a 9 out of 10. All these figures are more or less reused. I think you got a little bit of a new kind of thing with Dum Dum Doo in there. Obviously, this is the Black Widow body. But hey, I mean, they're great, right? It's not going to give it a 10. I'm going to give it a 9. I think it's a, a 9 set. And I'm happy to have all of these guys. Alright guys. That's going to do it for this one. There will be some more Transformers. Some more G.I. Joe Classified. And some more Marvel Legends. So like I said. Be on the lookout for all of that. If you're new to the channel. Uh, please like and subscribe. We're working our way up to 500 subscribers and then we're gonna go for the big one a thousand by the end of 2024 i certainly appreciate your help in helping me get there and i'll see you all tomorrow with another video peace the way i got it figured